got this guy, man. Oh. Today, the Manual Swap 240SX is going out for a little adventure and photo shoot. Just got this new camera, so as we enjoy the sunny weather and windy roads, I'll be taking pit stops along the way to show off some of my photos, but more importantly, show off the car and the scenic views. Well, yeah, comparing this car to my FC, it's very nice to have the power steering, and then this one has an aftermarket exhaust, so it sounds very nice and responsive. Should be in, eh, I guess third gear was fine through there. I'm not sending it, so. This is uh, actually an S14 transmission. This was automatic when it first arrived, but did a manual swap because the automatic transmission on these things is pretty not good. So it's a lot more fun now. South Bay, Los Angeles. There's aftermarket suspension on this thing. It feels very stable through the corners. They're a good tour guide, I should say. I cut the mustard. I'm sorry. Ah, it was pretty clear there. Biker. Not sure what they're doing. I'll let them go by. Yeah, I'll, I'll go by, I guess. Maybe they like the 240. No, they're still there. Don't understeer into me. Whoa! That's sick. The Porsche Club's here. Aesthetic. Okay. Miata. I really like the trees there. All right, so I found this cute little spot. It's really quiet here with a nice view, so. Hopefully these pictures are coming out pretty nice. This thing is so fun to drive. I cannot understate that. But it really makes me want to get my RX-7 perfected and make the driving experience a lot more fun. It was a very sunny and bright day, so the sun glare off the car and strong shadows were both a blessing and a curse. The nice naturey green backdrop and the bright blue sky really paired with the red 240 very nicely. In this picture, I wish I had gone for a lower angle so I could have fit the top of the tree in, but you live and you learn. Anyways, back to cruising. 
You're wondering why I'm driving so slow. This is actually where the cops got me at night. So I'm not trying to go anywhere over the speed limit here. I'm just following the flow of traffic. Even they are going a little bit fast. The cop was hiding on the other side of the street there with the radar or the laser. And it's pitch black here during the, the night, so you can't really see anything. So they got me good. Actually, I think it was right there in that little alcove straight ahead. And then they turned the lights on, like the big bright uh, floodlights. Yeah, right there. Right near the park sign. So they, they clocked my speed here. And then I knew I was done for. And then a cop came out at the light and pulled me over. And I was like, ah. Okay. Let's roll. Turning radius of the 240 check right here. At the second Very spot, nice. I tried to get a shot of the ocean in the background since I didn't get one earlier. The sun was even brighter at this time, so the glare was even stronger on the car. On top of this, the shadow on the dark side of the car was very very dark this made it really hard to get the settings just right so i think i should try to find a better spot next time that fits my needs however in the next photo i tried to take advantage of the location and was shooting on the more well-lit side of the car and i was playing around with the shutter speed so i could get a cool blurry shot of the passing car in the background that mercedes was pretty cool looking so i think it's pretty neat and playing around with the settings is how you learn Beautiful view. Oh shit. Cops got him. Cops got this guy, man. Jaguar right here. curb that poor guy let's take one for the team that's why you don't speed up here guys it's just not worth it they got me once but they, they didn't pull me out the car
Some nice trees, soccer trees. Like and subscribe if you guys want to see this type of video for the RX-7 FC as well.